Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is part nine of Tableau Desktop certification series. Before starting this video, if you have not subscribed to the channel, hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon for upcoming and interesting videos. So without any further delay, let's get started. First question of the video is in which situation you should save a workbook as a PDF documents. Options are user have Tableau Desktop but not Tableau Reader. This is wrong option. You want document user to be able to filter and sort the view. This is also wrong. We can't do filter and sort the views in PDF. Analysis does not require a live connection to the data. So this is also wrong. There is a no need to use connection with the PDF document. You need to maintain local hard copies for reference. This is right because when you need to keep the workbook or the worksheet or the dashboard with you as a hard copy you use PDF options. Okay, so option D is right. Next question is from a taboo desktop. We need to share the view as an image file. How we can share it. So option R dashboard menu then copy image dashboard menu export image format menu copy formatting file menu save as let's say we need to export only this dashboard so how we can do it we can go to dashboard then go to export image and from here we can save it okay so the right option is from the dashboard menu go to export image okay that is option b next question is invalid format of exporting is export as workbook export as image export as data none of the above let's create a sheet let's drag category and then drag discount okay and if we go to worksheet go to export we get three options export as an image export as in data export as cross tab to excel okay let's see which one is invalid from here export as workbook okay so the right option is a next question is what does a url action do on a dashboard options are display a drop down list with a filter option that user can click open a web page of a web based resource from an action on the source sheet used to connect the web based data to create a data source used to filter the data between two views on a dashboard okay first see how we can use url action so let's say we have created this worksheet let's create a dashboard and drag it here okay and now go to dashboard or go to action or simply you can click control plus shift plus d automatically this box will open okay from here you can go to go to url okay and here you can see we want to apply on that select part and so let me add the link of my youtube channel here and click on okay click on okay so whenever you click and you can see it will open the link okay in a new tab so this is how a url action will work so from here it opens a web page of a web based resource from an action on the source sheet okay so option b is right next question is when exporting a worksheet as an image in a tableau which of the following format are available in the tableau select all option are dot bmp dot png dot svg dot jpg let's try it let's say we have the same worksheet and we want to export it go to export go to image and click on save edge okay so when you click on this save as type you can see we get the option of dot png dot bmp dot svg or dot jpg If we go here, we can see all options are matching. Right answer is all A, B, C, and D. Okay. Next question is 
which of the following are valid ways to copy a worksheet option are by simply click control plus v click on the analysis menu copy and then image click on a worksheet menu copy and image right click on the worksheet viz and copy let's see if we press control plus v so what it will do is it will, it will create a new connection to the workbook which is uh, not a valid option here let's go back here click on the analysis menu go to copy and image let's go to analysis menu and you can see we don't have any option to copy the image so this is also wrong next option is click on the worksheet menu go to copy and then image to use the worksheet menu let's go to worksheet and go to here if we go to copy copy and then we get image data and crop depth we don't get the option to copy it so this is also wrong last option is right click on the worksheet viz and then copy when we click on it and copy and then if we go and paste it you can see it has created a new copy of it okay you can see we have copied it and pasted it here okay let me undo this and so the right answer is d next question is we need to share the workbook to anyone who doesn't have access to the data source and the external files associated with the workbook the workbook has to be shared in what format option r dot twb dot twbx dot td or all of the above so the right answer is twbx to know more about this you can refer this article i will provide the link of this article in the description box which has all the extension present in the tab view okay so the right answer is b let's move to the next set next question is we need to save a workbook in a tab view as a pdf we need to use options are presentation mode in the toolbar file save to pdf worksheet export to pdf file save as question 8 and 9 are similar question in the question 8 it is asking to save as a pdf and here it is asking to save as a powerpoint and we need to use if we want to save a worksheet as a pdf or powerpoint first we have to go to file and if you are saving as a pdf then you can go to print pdf and click on it and from here you can choose the option and click on ok this is how you can save as a pdf or once you save it you will get the option you can see this is how a pdf look like once you save it okay and if we want to save it as a presentation mode our powerpoint go to here and export as a powerpoint and you can choose if you want to use this view specific sheet from this dashboard specific sheet from this workbook okay let's say i want to go with this view and go with export and let me change it powerpoint terms okay and click on okay now you can see it is saved once you open it so first sheet you will get the title of the worksheet and when the file is created and then then your dashboard or your worksheet in the ppt format okay so for question 8 right option is b and for question 9 also right option is b next question is which three elements are included in package workbook dot twbx choose three options are background image a pdf copy of the workbook custom shapes tableau data source customization dot td c file or extract file so the right option is so the right options are background image custom shapes and extract file because tableau doesn't have dot tdc file and to save a pdf copy of the workbook we have to go to file and save it okay if you want to know more about dot twbx files you can refer this article from here you can see twbx stores background image custom geocoding 
custom shapes, local queue files, micro access files, Excel file, dot hyper, and text file etc. I will provide the link of this article in the description box. Okay. So the right options are A and E. Next question is what is dot TBM file? Table bookmark, tableau bookmark, tableau bin mark, tableau data extract. So the right option is tableau bookmark. That is our option B. Next question is dot TDSX file contains data and workbook. Options are true or false. So right answer is false as TDX contains the data but doesn't contain the workbook. Okay. To know more about this, you can refer this article. You will get the table package data source. You can read more about dot TDX file from this article. So the right answer is B. Next question is what is dot TDE file? Tableau workbook, Tableau data extract, Tableau data source, none of the above. Dot TDE file is Tableau data extract. That is option B. Next question is data source file have dash extension. Dot TDE, dot TDS, dot TDSX, dot TWBX. TD. Right option is dot TDS. That is our option B. You can refer the same article to know more about this. Okay. That is our dot TDS data source file dot TDS. Okay. So apart from this, we will focus one more article that is how to publish a workbook and what are the option we'll get. So whenever you create a dashboard and you publish to the Tableau server or the Tableau cloud, you will get this this pop up option to fill out the details. So location is basically the folder name on the Tableau server where you want to publish your dashboard. Okay, title is the dashboard name and description. If you want to add a description of your dashboard, you can add it here. Tags is basically if you want to add some tags related to this dashboard, you can add it here. Sheets is basically how many sheets you have selected when you are going to publish your dashboard to the server. Let's say you are having 10 sheets, but you want to publish only eight so you can go to edit and select those eight and publish it okay permissions are basically uh, defined by tableau admin if you don't get the edit option for the permission means it is locked data source is basically how many data source you have connected to this workbook so you you will get the option here more option is basically show sheet as a tab and so selection so you can choose based on your requirement okay so you will get all these options try to remember all this and for the data source you will get two option one, one is embedded and one is published data source okay published data source that is present on the tableau server embedded data source is connected to a particular dashboard okay you can read more about embedded versus public data source i will provide the link in the description box okay i think that's it for this video thank you so much guys if you like the video please do like share and subscribe and stay tuned for upcoming videos